Live. Welcome back. The time is 627. An eating disorder once ruled the life of Olympic diver Kimiko Soldati. In today's Helen Magazine segment, we'll introduce you to this local talent and show you how she won the battle and became a champion. Yeah! It wasn't long ago that West Lafayette resident Kimiko Soldati was gracing the covers of magazines and diving towards the ultimate goal, the Olympics. But a devastating eating disorder almost crushed that dream. It started with just the obsession of body and body weight and body image. She says some of the very same characteristics that made her a champion also led to an eating disorder. When in diving, I mean, the goal is perfect tense. And so that's what you're striving for is perfection. And I was totally under the illusion that I could achieve it, um, not just in diving. But At one point, she says she was spending every free moment working out and was obsessed with every calorie going in her body. It was a monster. I mean, it just took over my life. Unlike many who struggle with an eating disorder, Soldati came forward to ask for help. I knew that I could not control it anymore. It took a lot of time and a lot of hard work, but she eventually overcame the eating disorder. Now she shares her message with others. I want to have a message of hope that you can get through this, you can get over this. It's not an easy road by any means. Yeah! Today, Soldati and her family live in West Lafayette. Her husband, Adam, is the diving coach at Purdue, and she volunteers as an assistant coach. And together, they are a powerful team. And for more information on stories in the Helen Magazine, you can go to our website, WLFI.com. Just a really interesting woman to speak with. She's had a crazy story. Such an interesting Such success. Life. Yeah, and such success, and all while battling this disease. Yeah, mm -hmm. amazing, amazing. Mm -hmm.